What's up YouTube? It's Adam back again. Hi, it's next Saturday and I have another project today with CarMax and leasing. I'm a leasing expert. I've been working in the auto finance industry for about 10 years, not on the dealer side. I specialize in leases and I like doing trades and selling cars to CarMax, kicking cash value out of these used cars in the current used car market and turning them into brand new cars. So today, I'm going to take this 2009 manual 5-speed tra transmission Honda Civic that just pretty much sits in my driveway, and I'm going to take it to CarMax, see how much I can get offered for it. Today, I'm not really trying to put any cash in my pocket. I'm really just going to try and leverage the value in this car and pay down the, ne the new car I want to get as much as possible, and I'm looking to get a payment of $200 or less. Now, today's car is actually going to be for my wife. She's pregnant with my second child. Con yay, congrats. To us we're having a baby boy this time to add to our beautiful little daughter perfect family of four so this car is very important to me um, we're actually going from a zero car payment this thing's paid off I don't pay anything but insurance on this to a brand new car payment so the goal is a little different right last week I was taking a 2018 turning it into a 2021 and just trying to replace the payment keep it equivalent and actually make some money and put some in my pocket which I was actually able to do it's a pretty cool video you guys should check it out Today's project, like I said, is just take this car, get as much as I possibly can for it, leverage that towards the next one, and hopefully get a good payment, get a good car for my wife to drive, something that we can tote the kids around in, um, but we're looking for a low payment. So we're looking for a small, compact, most likely a Honda HRV is what we're thinking. Could be a Civic, not sure. You can tell I like Hondas. Um, I think they're great cars, really good engines, reliable. I trust them with my family, so. That's what we're going to do. So I hope you guys want to come along for the day. Um, I have no idea how it's going to turn out just like last week, but I'm pretty confident in my knowledge and myself and the current used car market. Um, let's see what we can do. Here it is. Today's CarMax trade-in project. This is a 2009 manual five-speed transmission Honda Civic LX that pretty much just sits in my driveway. Um, so we're going to take it up to CarMax and see what we can get for it. Talk more about it here in just a second. What's up YouTube? I'm back. Just got home for a little pit stop from CarMax. Um, went ahead and got an offer from them. It wasn't exactly what I was hoping for. Um, here I'll show it to you here. Um, it's $3,800 is what they offered. So I was hoping, you know, at a minimum of getting four, I think I'm going to need to spend at least four at the dealership to get the new car I want down to where I want. So, you know, that's kind of, that's close. You know, I have to spend 200 extra, but wait, take a look at this. We have other options. CarMax is not the only uh, company in this space. And there's people competing with CarMax, like Carvana, Vroom. So hold please, check out this second offer. Boom, you see that from Carvana? Over $6,000 offered on that exact same car. They're offering well over Kelly Blue Book. They even acknowledge that. Only I can think of is they're trying to compete. Um, you know, weirdly enough, last weekend on the 2018, they offered less. So CarMax last weekend was my go-to because they offered the highest dollar for that new car. Now on this 2009, I don't know why, but uh, Carvana seems to be the way to go. So I'm gonna go with that. I'm gonna count on about five grand um, from that deal, you know, if they show up and it goes down a little bit, I, you know, I would imagine that could possibly happen. They haven't seen the car. They have to inspect it. But CarMax looked at it. Um, Carvana knows they're offering more. So definitely going to go with the Carvana offer, 6400 Heck, I might have cash over again, get a new car um, with some cash left. Now, you know, the more I spend today at the dealership, the lower my payment's going to be over the next three years. And I'm going to lease this next car. So, you know, I'm going to spend what I need to to get the payment where I need to. Um, but I'm pretty happy, you know, never works out like you say it's going to work out. It always goes a little different, but it's really cool that in this space, there's multiple options. So CarMax isn't the only way to go. It looks like Carvana is going to be our, our winner today. So uh, taking a little lunch break. Um, I called the dealer, let them know we're coming, have some cars ready, the ones I want to look at. I got some negotiation ideas this time. It's going to be a little bit of a harder made deal. You know, last weekend was easy. Uh, today we're really going to get to the nitty gritty and, and get the best possible deal for my wife and my kids and the car that um, I'm going to put them in. So stay tuned. Uh, here we go to the dealership. I'm excited, pretty confident. You know, you never know what's going to happen. So stay tuned. We'll see.
And once again, if you like any of this, please hit like, please subscribe. My name's Adam, I'm a lease expert, and follow along while I go and buy another car. Well guys, looks like we did it again. Uh, just made a deal. We're drafting up the paperwork right now. We got the 2021 HRV. Went with the silver again. You can tell the theme there. I seem to like silver cars, I guess. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go inside. I'm gonna sign the contract, and we're about to leave on this bad boy two weeks in a row. Two new cars, and I'll tell you some more details about the numbers and how it all worked out. Once again, didn't go exactly how we planned, but it went pretty well, and actually a lot more in line with my plan. So uh, stay tuned, and I will give you some more details here in a few. car second weekend in a row it's still pretty early once again in and out of the dealership in just about two hours I mean today went exactly I mean it went great I'm not gonna lie like it, it pretty much went exactly as I wanted it to how I planned it um, the details I'm about to share with you are pretty cool um, so got home with a brand new 2021 HRV LX model base model um, Today, what I wanted to happen was to get that car for around $21,000, which I was able to do. Um, I wanted to spend about $4,000 of the $6,400 that I'm gonna, I got for the, the Civic that I sold to Carvana and get a payment under $200. And that's exactly what happened. So, um, got the car for $21,700. Um, starting price was $23,692. So, did some negotiating there. I think I could probably make a whole video on negotiating with the dealer and how to actually do that and how to be successful at it. Um, does it work exactly the way you think? Um, and um, also, you know, buying two cars two weekends in a row was a big help. You know, I learned a lot last weekend. Um, I dealt with the same guy twice in a row, so he got to sell two cars two weekends in a row. Um, and we were able to make a really good deal and it worked for everybody. And um, first I want to show you you know some of the details so you can see what I'm talking about so like I said the sticker price that they had listed with the car in the lot was twenty three thousand six hundred ninety two dollars so let me show you that all right as you can see that was in the window and the sticker price on the car they had on the lot I knew that I needed to pay that thing down enough you know, where my starting price, I needed to be around 21,000. So my goal was to get it for $21,200. And I ended up getting it for 21,700. So 500 within goal, almost $2,000 under their sticker price, which, you know, if that wasn't able to be done, then the whole deal wouldn't have worked. So the dealer wanted to sell the car. So obviously he made it happen for me. Um, really great. So let me go ahead and run through the contract with you. So I had to put the 4,000 down. Um, and that's what got me down to the 177 payment. I could have gone with the 10,000 mile a year per lease and had like a 170 payment for like $6 more a month. I got the 12,000, that just makes way more sense. Um, why risk it, just have six more dollars a month. You know, I still had, you know, another thousand dollars in my pocket. You know, I could have technically paid another thousand down, gotten the payment even lower, like sub maybe like 150. I think it was paying down about 39 or, no, yeah, $29 per thousand but that's not what I wanted to do right I had the money um, but I wanted to keep some I really only wanted to spend about four and so I spent exactly what I wanted got a payment of $177 exactly what I wanted now my wife my kids have a great lease at a really good price that we can afford um, let me go ahead and run through the contract real quick so you can see exactly what I'm talking about and I can prove it to you all right guys here's the contract Agreed upon value of the vehicle, 21700 35 more months or 36 months total with one payment already made at one seventy seven ninety seven. You see 4000 down. There's our 4000 down right there. 36 months at one seventy seven ninety seven. So there it is. All right, guys, real quick, before we go over the details of the contract I just showed you, I just wanted to say that none of this is financial advice. Um, I'm not telling you to go sell your car. I'm just showing you what I did and how it went for me. 
as you can see, those were the terms on the contract that I just showed you that I signed today for this new Honda HRV 2021 that my wife will be driving with my two kids. Um, so it went great. Like once again, wow, like I'm just really happy with how all this went. Um, you know, so let's run through it real quick. So today I actually went with Carvana over CarMax. Had I gone with CarMax, I would have to spend $200 to make this deal, which, you know what, if that was, if that actually had gone down and I didn't have this other offer from Carvana, I'd probably be happy with that too. To be honest, that would have been fine. Um, but it worked out way better than that. So always double check between all of these companies are competing with each other. Definitely that worked for me today. So what we did was we sold a 2018 Honda Civic that had no payment on it. It was five speed, man, automatic, I mean manual transmission. Um, CarMax offered $3,800 and Carvana offered $6,400. So we definitely went with Carvana this time. Um, we took $5,000 to the dealership um, with the intention of spending only four, getting a brand new 2021 HRV for my wife and a payment under 200 bucks. And that's exactly how it went down. So we paid the 4,000 down, got a payment of 177 um, for three year lease, 12,000 miles per year. And still have $2,400 left over from the sale to Carvana. I mean, once again, two weekends in a row, two brand new cars, pockets full of money each time. If you add up each weekend, 1,500 plus 2,400. So I mean, $3,900 in cash and two cars. Um, now the you know that 3900 you know the, the new HRV is a brand new payment so I'm spending 177 a month so when I do the math there you know I'm not really up over the three years but for the deal I was looking for I wanted a car I needed a car that was perfect I got exactly what I needed so my advice is if you have a used car look into its value how much are you paying a month wouldn't you rather get a brand new car for that same payment and maybe even some cash in your pocket like. It can be done. I've been doing it. I think I'm gonna keep doing it. Um, I told y'all I was gonna do an MDX next. This is the car that I decided to do with this next. The MDX I think is actually coming soon. Um, so stick around, come back, let's do this together some more. Um, hit that like button, please subscribe. My name's Adam, I'm a leasing expert. Um, I'm taking advantage of the current used car market, I'm taking you guys along for the ride. I'm making money, I'm getting new cars, and I wanna keep doing it. So. If you need some advice or want some help or if you know me and you'd like to have me maybe look at your details and tell you what I think or even you know give you an assist, we can talk. So let me know. Um, this is a lot of fun. Um, I'm really enjoying it. Uh, my wife and my daughter are taking a nap right now and it's still the middle of the afternoon. Didn't waste my whole day at the dealership. Got an awesome deal, a brand new car, money in my pocket. I mean, this Let's keep doing this. That's all I gotta say. Thank you, YouTube. I'm having a lot of fun. My videos will get better. This is brand new to me. Um, I'm just gonna keep sharing with you guys what I know, what I'm doing. And if you like it, hit subscribe, hit like, and let's keep come along for the ride. Let's keep going.